This ought to work. Well, so why are we here exactly? Heard Carey got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where'd you hear anything about Carey? In and about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh, right. You weren't around. Mm-hmm. Your boy's night out. So what? Wanna pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. So, I gotta hit Carrie's digs, look around, critique the drapes. Know what they're writing about him? He's depressed, attempted suicide. What, really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. Meaning you want to go in person? Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. Mm-hmm. First rogue, now carry. Who's next on the list of conjugal visits? Nobody. Just so happens the list of people I consider friends and who are still alive is pretty damn short. Exactly why I need to talk to Carrie. What was that about attempted suicide? Amateur hour. Didn't even cobble together the right audience. Tried to put a bullet through his skull in his room. Bodyguard took his gun like candy from a baby. Could just be the rumor mill. Sure, could. But I want to know. Okay. But I want to know what you plan to do. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V Care was always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first, we gotta get into that house. Okay. Just let me know when you wanna take the wheel. Fugly as seafood barf. Hope it was expensive, at least. Something's gotta justify this level of tacky. Now, oh, fuck. Cookie cutter crap straight from a catalog. Doubt Carrie picked this. Always ate out. Always. Bet he sits here and thinks, the fuck I need all this shit for? Probably the only actual necessity in this whole pad. All right. I'll give him that one. Ah, oh, beautiful butterfly Carrie emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. Looks like he's showering. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay. <sighs> Feels so much better. Now let's see what you're up for show and what you're actually strummable. Keep playing. All right. Carrie? Carrie? No. <laughs> no. no That's some fucking joke. Hang on. What did Silverhand tell me before he died? There's a test. Could just play you another song. Answer me. Told you to leave Samurai. Go your own way. Clearly I was right, as I often am. 
Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Um, motherfucker! Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh, fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. So you changed a bit. Nice rack. Sporting a new style? Yeah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Johnny. Oh, man. I need a drink. All right. Come on. Tell me. Why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? This is V. You'd like her? The fuck, Johnny? Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck you, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Mm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Live here all by your lonesome? Nah, got my cook, Ariel, but he's off today. Miguel, what am I? Not your biz, Jill. Sit down, start talking. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. As sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair, or cool and relaxed in orbit, and now you've just popped by to shit all over my life? Well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Oh, it is a heartbreaker. Oh, fuck! Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Looking at him now, those really were the best of times. Playing fucking rat infested dumps. Argued before every gig. Had no idea what we wanted to play, and never had Ned do our name. Nancy? Control freak. Henry smelled like zappers and piss. I was always stealing your pants. Hella good times, man. Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart imp, that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would've had to get in line, that's why. Stuff about you being depressed. You true? Nope. Promo strategy. Suicide attempts too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butthurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me. Got no answer to that. Still in touch with the gang? Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Works for N54 News. Good. Track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together? You know, jam or something? Bess Isis. Damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper with a thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? Could ask her yourself. 
Henry probably killed his own liver. That would have hurt if he was gone. Got mutual friends. A few calls and I should be able to track him down. Then he might still be in the base. Actually had talent in his spine. Yeah, released something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. You want to bring Samurai back? I don't know. Could do one gig, play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. But I won't have to explain what happened. All this? Nah, we'll spare him. Hella boring story. Biochips, Parasaka's evil schemes. Magic pills. We'll just say you're my new output. All right, let's do it. Fuck yeah! Okay! Send you Nancy's number in a sec. I'll go after Henry and Denny. Mm. I'm not there. Figure it out with V. Sure. Uh, you two get along? Sure. Kid loves me. Yeah, I bet. Johnny, you okay? No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun at least? <laughs> that a hint of disapproval I hear? Just sit tight for a bit. Rest. Don't worry about a thing. The hell is this concert thing? Did you hear that? Gets sharper as the pills wear off. So? Want to see Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. Nah, this is different. Carrie needs this concert. Okay. Call in Nancy. Fuck yeah. Nice. Nancy? I mean... Bess? Bess Isis? No. This is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Steven, N54 News. How can I help? Wanna talk to Bess? She's not here. Calling from Carrie Uridine's residence. Cool. But Bess still isn't here. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. If anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Got a bad feeling, V. Think we better... Come on, up you go. Like your style. Minimalist. Used to have chrome just like that. Start moving. Tense too? Fuck yeah. Third floor. H press the button. Hip. Well, my fingers are numb. At Royce had some fucking fuck. No fucking way. Remember that tape from All Foods? That's the Rimbo who did Royce. No, 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 no. Wouldn't be that stupid to show up here. You the one? Looking for Bess Isis. Guess I gotta spell it out. You the one took out Royce? Yeah. What, anyone actually boo-hoo when he went? Uh, look at this. 
the chance at a nick in the barrel. Get the fuck out! Now! That's the All Foods part. I'm not blind! What do you want? Watch out for that one. You the one in charge now? No! A lot's changed since Royce went, but not that much! Bess Isis. Mean anything to you? You work with her? No, just gotta talk. Heard she's here. She's here, but you talk to Brick first. Let's call what happens to you. I'll take you. So Brick's in for Royce now. Yeah, heard what happened at All Foods. Probably thinking Brick will be grateful, huh? What, that'd disappoint you? No, and Brick's not in a position to demonstrate feelings of any kind. Yeah, if by alternative, you mean we don't give a fuck what people think. Okay, then let's say extreme music. What's that mean to you? Look, lady, you keep trying to slap a label on us. No, I'm trying to understand you. Chaos, a wall of noise and distortion. It must all form the some Frank, got another guest. V, what a surprise. What can I do for you? That's nice. It's like I'm interrupting. Ramping up, actually. Percy has overstayed her welcome. Yet I still haven't gotten answers to all my questions. Make something up. You're a journalist. Should be second nature. Say, it's an orgy of noise or whatever. Seems your people are holding a grudge. <laughs> hold those better than they hold their iron. Show a little understanding. Try not to piss them off. Carrie Uridine sent me, with some biz for Bess. Carrie? Did he suddenly remember I exist? You can go. Huh? Just like that? I ask you. No. That's what I thought. Trying to run a business here. Thanks, Brick. That was... enlightening. Let's go. Let's Delta. Appreciate it. Thanks. Seems all right. Sure. Just too bad he doesn't know squat about music. That's what you wanted to talk to him about? Yeah. Tinnitus. The Totentad sound. What I got out of Brick was scop. Slow in this dump. Cars outside. So what? Giving up on your story? I won't learn anything about Maelstrom's music? Got lots of footage. Need to look through it, see what I can patch together. Oh, for fuck's sake! Ah, oh, could've been worse. This way you got a souvenir. Fuck souvenirs. I'm headed straight back to the editing room. Wanna talk? Gotta come with me. Conquer like this. Hope it gets us there. One piece. All right. So what's Carrie want? Wants to bring back Samurai. One gig. One night. There is no samurai without Silverhand. Gonna be a gig in Silverhand's honor. What's got into Carrie all of a sudden? Thought he got over this ages ago. Well, guess it doesn't really matter. What's in it for me? 
A reunion with some old friends. Ah, come on. Carrie and Johnny were friends. That's it. We just floated around, sometimes got in their way. So what do you want? An interview with Carrie? <laughs> Could write that myself, straight out of my ass. I'd want access to all his industry contacts, associates. Eh, yeah, not a problem. Not as far as I can see. We're here. Hop out. All right, so the concert? <sighs> Tell Carrie I'll put it together. Be in touch. Okay, thanks. Pretty damn well. Now call Carrie. Be in touch. Considering renting or purchasing hey. for yourself. So how'd it go? Talk to Nancy. In touch with yep, she agreed. Even Oklahoma. said she'd organize the gig. Still a control freak. Awesome. Managed to contact Henry or Denny? Just Henry so far. Dragged him out of rehab. Great story, actually. Henry didn't know Denny's been in Night City all this time. On his way over to see her now. Gonna be a surprise. We're all gonna meet over at Denny's. What, me too? Why? You're gonna play with us, aren't you? We gotta meet the others. Send you the address. See, Carrie beat us here. You fucking ghost! Who boy? Danny, what? Sounds sadly familiar. What are you doing here? V. Uh, good you're this here. This is really your house? You got a problem. This is your fucking pool? Is this supposed you're to be Henry's surprise? Piece of shit. Yeah, I obviously you missed a few beats. Just so Looks I can like come back again. He was holding some sort of grudge. Maybe so then, he flooded the pool with the concrete. You left me to die in the street. Henry did often get emotional. Left you to die? Ugh, I wish you, know you what happened would between them? die. From what I've come to understand, one day, then he disappeared without a word. Get the fuck then hit from Henry. I imagine that wasn't too hard, in his state of mind, already? either out of it no or in rehab. Tour. Yep. That is, until I gave Henry her address. Go anywhere near them in your What about day? the concert? I haven't gotten a chance to not, ask Denny yet. Doesn't look good, though. V, talk to them. Carrie will just what? make it worse. They don't know? <sighs> not really my biz. Go, don't know go. What? They'll get past it I lost it years sick. of my life to a Carrie didn't bag. piss all over himself out of joy when he saw me yeah. either. Fuck. <laughs> that how you remember it? Remember a hell of a lot more than you. This your backup? In case you forgot why the hell you came here in the first place? Carrie sent me. About the concert. What concert? Why isn't he here talking to me? Look, it's awkward. Carrie considers you both friends. What a sensitive guy. Shit. Given he's the one who set this flaming turd bag on my doorstep. We're bringing back Samurai. One night only. That's what he wants to get the crew together for? Sweet, but no fucking way. Not about to play with this shit stain. Danny! No, no way. Either him or me. Choose. Danny digs in her heels, we're done. How's it going? Like shit, man! Danny wants me out of the gig! And we already agreed on everything! What? Carrie's paying you? That's what this is about? Fuck. It's all fucking great. So you get him away from me and get the fuck off my lawn. Don't make me choose. Got something on your mind, V? Pretty sure it's your call. Fuck really pisses me off. Denny's on a control kick, setting conditions. On the other hand, Henry's got scop for brains. Can't trust him. Thanks. Real helpful. Mm. You out of your fucking mind with the pool? You knew Carrie wanted to get Denny to play with us. Just wanted to clear the air. Fucking Prem.
Maybe if someone would tell me what happened. Are you blind? Fucker filled my pool with cement. Maybe he had a good reason. Really? A reason? Gotta go without one or the other. Uh, yeah, not a problem. Should be able to borrow someone else for one gig. Won't be the same, though. It won't ever be the same, Carrie. <sighs> if we gotta choose, let's play with Denny. Fuck, Carrie! Seriously? She's the one making a big deal out of this, not me! Listen, I'll get you- You know what, Carrie? Fuck you! Good thing Silverhand isn't here to see this. You done? Get out. All right, what about Nancy? We make contact. She's gonna set it all up and let us know. See you at the show. Fuck. Now I gotta find someone to clean this up. Okay, about all we can do for now. Except wait for Nancy to call. Everything okay? No. Just the sight of that douche wad reminded me how not okay it is. Don't worry, though. I'll be past it by showtime. Wonder what Henry did to her. So his fault after all. Well, normally, Denny's not a raging bitch. Well, pretty sure she knew Henry wanted this concert. Hmm. Doubt she really gave a fuck about the pool. Hey. Gigs all set up super sweet like tonight at the Red Dirt. Talk to Carrie? Didn't change his mind or anything? No, no, not at all. He's pretty stoked, in fact. Haven't seen him like this since the Silverhand days. What about Henry? Still not on board? Didn't even try. Not wasting my breath on that dick tip. Well, so, see you tonight. And don't worry about your axe. Got the gear all rounded up. Oh, yeah. Hey, V. Fuck this country. V. Got something for you. Don't know if you know, but once upon a time, this was Silverhands. Fuck. Nancy just gets shit done. She just whisper Mikoshi in her ear. We'll be all set. How about you tell me what happened with Henry? Ancient history. Kept falling into all sorts of crap, then I'd have to dig him out. You got tired of getting your hands dirty all the time. All wrong. Managed to get him a gig with a decent band. Henry quit using, got his shit together. Things were going great, so he booted me out of his life. And what happened next? You get off on this sort of drama? He ditched me. Partied with his new pals for a month. Then they tossed him out, because he started acting up again. Ran into him on the street. Total mess. Gonk even fainted for effect. The tug at my heartstrings. What'd you do? Left him right there, and made damn sure he couldn't find me again. How are you feeling ahead of the show? Weird. Like, I'm about to pretend to be myself. Plus, Johnny's out. Never thought I'd say I missed the bastard. But, damn well do. Thanks for putting the gig together. Please. Carrie couldn't twiddle his own asshole without my help. Silverhand was probably the same. <laughs> Worse. At least Carrie did what I told him to do, kept out of my hair. Where's Carrie? Should be here any minute. Told me you play really well. Better be true. Because there won't be a dress rehearsal. Right. Can't let that full house down. Honestly, got no idea who these people are. Just strays. Carrie didn't want word to get around. Yeah. Well, we'll see about that. You think the media caught wind of this? For sure. Hyenas. 
I'd worry more about Henry's replacement. Carrie got Drowson from Cutthroat to join us. I know him. Seen him play. And? Ain't he good? He's fine. Just fine. You're the mystery dish here. Pill time. Just be discreet. And if I start puking blood again... Don't go making a scene. This is Carrie's big night. I got a feeling Nancy doesn't think I can keep up with him. Well, she's right. Ready to thrash? Have fun. Motor. There you are. This is Drowson. In Cutthroat. Hey, big fan. Huge fan. You too? Got all their albums? I mean, I never Chill, dreamed that. She's in the same boat as you. Want to talk to a star? Talk to me. And get that shake it under control. I think my shake's the same. Or worse. Brad got your stress raising me. Fuck you. And missed you too. All right, let's do this. something to prove to myself to you whoever the fuck but all I did was 
Have a good time. That's it. Want to do it again? Huh? No. That was enough. In that case, here. Take it as a souvenir. You sure? Won't play without you. Just wouldn't be the same. See what you're doing here. But I still plan on playing. can still hear you. Thanks, but not in the mood for hovering tables and voices from beyond the grave right now. Feeling tired, bored, powerless. Maybe you should hang on to this, actually. Experience all of Chromanticore's 16 new flavors and make sense. That was the gig. Helloprene. <laughs> Samurai's found its new growth. Damn shame I had to miss it. Yeah, you'd still come to my show. No, you shouldn't have. Really. The very gun I tried to shoot Johnny with when he broke into my house. Meaning you tried to shoot me? Yeah. And earlier... And... Never mind. Cool. Feel like I fell asleep and woke up 50 years later. Back to work, then. Take care, V. I'll be in touch. V, how are you feeling? I can't believe that asshole Carrie just up and left you like this. Guess he had somewhere to be. Badly. Probably writing a new song as we speak. Isn't that what you wanted? To make him feel better? Better, but not that good. Johnny, don't ever leave me again. I can't live without you. A little of that could go a long way. Hope that's it for last requests. I'm not sure I can handle anymore. It is, and I'm starting to regret you agreed to this concert thing. <sighs> Here I thought I'd hear. Thank you, V. Said it was important to you. This thing with Carrie. It was. But not more important than you. Carrie's got his life back. Whereas we should be worrying about how to get yours back. Let's go. Anything like it. And you're not likely to again. Well, you do all right? Mm hmm. Too damn well. Got me wondering where Carrie's been hiding you all this time. Wait a sec, isn't this where Samurai played its first gig? Ah, oh, what a night. There's still legends about it. The music was so loud they had to replace all the windows. They made a new rule refusing service to new customers. There's a special on the menu just for samurai fans. Ribs a la Silverhand. Pricey, sure, but you won't stop licking your fingers. What? No, no, I hit it too hard. It was fine. Great. Axe went out of tune after chipping in. No worries. You can't hit the base anyway. Have a good time. Hell yeah! Carrie even said I'm gonna see some Eddie. You were great. Oh, first time I ever heard that at a gig. Thanks. Uh, what's up, gorgeous? <laughs> 